Welcome to Virtualoon. Today I want to show you the ruler. The ruler is available in some of the tools, most of the tools, in the plus wall, in the X wall, in the column wall, arch tool, column tool, garland tool, flat arch and circle. Let's have a look what is possible to do with the roller tool. We start with a column. Okay, just create a column with a with a nice color. Let's see. Create the, the column, we make it a little smaller. Okay, now you have a column, you want to have a pattern in that column. Until now, it was quite complicated because you had to choose the color, drag it over. Choose the color, drag it over, over and over again. So now it's easier, you just say create again. Now, you choose the color you want to have with the roller, drag it over here. Then you click on the roller button, and when it's green, it's active. Now the roller colors balloons um, while you're not holding your mouse, your left mouse button down. As soon as you let it go, it will not color anything. So now I click the mouse, and nothing happens. I let go of the left mouse button, and now it starts coloring the balloons. And as you can see, the cursor changes from an arrow to four arrows. Do that again. This is way easier to change colors or make a pattern in your design because you don't have to drag and drop every single balloon. So let's finish this and then I will show you how it works in a wall because it's slightly different. Okay, and then you can turn it off again. Now let's go back to the plus wall. Same thing, you have the roller tool here. We need to choose some colors here. Or we can just leave it, just leave it for now. We create a wall and now we will change the balloons okay so let's see take a nice pastel drag it over here and now this is the filler balloons. If you turn on the roller, you can see the filler balloons will change. I missed some. Okay. Now, if you want to change the cross balloons now, you drag this over, but if you if you turn on the roller now, it will change these ones too. So make sure to change the other one back to the original. And now you can only color these. You have to turn it off and on again. And you can color these. This works the same way for the link loons or quick links or g links, whatever you call them. Okay, and make sure you don't touch these again because they will change again. Okay, have fun playing with the roller tool. Thanks for watching.